Hello, Ash class, and welcome to Friday's maths lesson, where we're going to be adding money together using the column method. Now, I know we looked at this yesterday, but today, as well as pence, we're also going to include pounds. So for my I do, I've got two pieces of very expensive fruit. I've got a strawberry for five pounds and 25 pence, and I've got a banana for one pound and 50 pence. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put them into my column method. And today we're gonna to write it out like this, where we have the five pounds and 25 pence. So it looks a little bit different to how we usually do our column method. Now we also have the hundreds column, and this is where we can find our pound coins. And our pound coins are in the hundred column because we know that one pound is the same as 100 pence. And five pounds is the same as 500 pence. So just like when we do regular column addition, the first column I'm gonna add up is the ones column. And I know that five add zero gives me five. I'm then going to add up my tens column. And I know that two tens add five tens gives me seven tens. And lastly, I'm going to add up my hundreds column where my pound coins are. And I know that five pounds add one pound equals six pounds. And remember, Today, we're going to write our answer six pounds and 75 pence. Let's try one together. So, for our we do, once again, we've got two very expensive fruit. We've got an apple for six pounds and 54 pence, and we have a lemon for two pounds and 35 pence. So once again, we'll put it into our column addition. Now, who can remember which column do we add up first? That's right, we add up the ones column. So see if you can work out what is four add five. Well done if you said nine, fantastic. Which is the next column that we have to add? That's right, we're gonna add the tens next. So can you try and work out what is five tens add three tens? Well done if you said eight tens. And lastly, we're going to add up the hundreds column where the pound coins are. So can you try and work out what is six pounds at two pounds? That's right, eight pounds. And remember, we're going to write our answer as eight pounds and 89 pence. So for your home learning today, you've got a couple of questions where you've got to add the fruit and vegetables together using the column method. Remember, if you're not sure or you're struggling a little bit, feel free to join one of our Zoom calls and we'll be happy to help.